what's going on youtube my name is simon snipe and welcome to the channel so in today's video i'm just going to do a very very quick run through of how did i actually bypass the shock bug which is uh, if you're using an emulator to actually play the global server where the shop doesn't really load this is how i was told that we can actually fix it and actually work for me so do give it a shot if it works for you great uh, if not then we have to try any other methods or if you have any other known method that actually works for you do leave it in the comment section below hopefully people who watch this video also will be able to see them So since I forgot to actually record it when I still had the bug on, this is how we're going to do it. The first thing you need to do is you need to go to your homepage of your BlueStacks, and then you have to go to your system apps, go to the Android settings, and then go to storage and head on over very bottom to the cache data. What you want to do is you want to clear this. And it's very important that you clear this because if it doesn't, doing the next few steps will probably not be able to fix it for you. Now, once the cache has been cleared, it will show zero right here, means it's absolutely clean. What you want to do next is you can probably close this right now. Okay, then go to your Google Play. So what you need to do is you will probably be prompted to actually re-log in again. Now, what you want to do, you have to click this button if you do see the screen. If not, just re-log in to the uh, Gmail account that you use to link to your Google Play Store and you should be fine. Now, the email that you use doesn't necessarily have to be the same email that you use to log in to count the site. The most important thing is for this particular BlueStacks instance, it's the, you just have to re-log in to your Google account. And once that is done, you just have to close it, go back to counter site, and then, whoops, <laughs> and then just go back to the shop. It will then be able to load just fine. Hopefully, this method is able to help you solve your problem. If not, like I said, do leave your known solutions in the comment section below. I'll be really, really glad that if you can share it with the community too. So I guess until the next video, I'll see you again soon. Bye.